In this video, I'm going to talk about how many edge nodes you should run and in what configuration you should run them. So stay tuned. Okay, first let's talk about staking your T fuel. The question is should I break it up over multiple edge nodes? Will it increase the amount of T fuel earnings I get? So I'm going to address that. First of all, I have run some tests on a single computer with a single edge node and calculated over a 24 hour period the amount of T fuel earned per 100,000 staked and if I staked just 100,000 and got that number then I staked 200,000 and got that number and I calculated for both of those the uh, T-Fuel rewards per 100,000 it was the same so you know breaking it up into two edge nodes with 100,000 each didn't make any difference in the amount of T-Fuel that was earned now obviously I did not run it on multiple computers but the thing to take into consideration is every computer that you operate 24 7 which you pretty much have to do if you want to run an edge node consumes electricity so if you run two computers your cost of electricity is going to be twice as much as what you would pay if you ran just one computer so I don't see the advantage to running multiple computers okay so if you are running a computer and your cost for electricity is $25 to run it 24 7 for a month and then you divide $25 by the current price of T fuel at 3.7 cents each that gives you 675 which means that the first 675 T fuel that you earn in a month goes to cover the cost of electricity. That's your break even point. So, are you going to earn more than that? And are you going to earn enough more than that to make it worthwhile to run a second computer and have to deal with the maintenance issues and everything else that goes along with that? I don't know, but I don't think I would. Now, based on that uh, argument, you may think, well, geez it doesn't sound like it would be uh, worthwhile running a first computer to run an edge node well you may think that and that may be true but the thing you got to think about is the more edge nodes that are online the more successful the theta network will be and even if you operated at a break even or maybe even a little bit of a loss uh, you are contributing to the success of the theta network which if you've got theta that's going to have a positive effect on the price of theta so you got to think about things like that and I'm willing to spend a little bit of money every month out of pocket to you know further the goal of the theta network and I'm gonna benefit because I hold some theta and the more successful the theta network is the uh, more value it adds to my theta and my T fuel so uh, you got to think about things like that too I think if you want to run multiple nodes the best way to do it is get an old server type computer that you can set up multiple virtual machines on one computer and have each one of them running an edge node and you would have to have each edge node obviously going to a separate wallet because from what I've seen from comments is that if you have two computers running two edge nodes into the same wallet you end up getting less T fuel than if you have them each have their own wallet I haven't run that test I'm just going on what others have said in the comments but that's my opinion if you want to run a bunch of edge nodes go find a used server there's plenty of them out there to be had and set it up with multiple VMs you know Windows 10 and run the VM or there's other VM products that you can buy but to me that's the most efficient way to run multiple edge nodes if that's what you choose to do now keep in mind somewhere down the road and I suspect it's probably going to be when they release mainnet 3.0 I suspect that there's going to be code in there that is going to make it difficult for you to run multiple edge nodes you'll probably be able to trick them somehow maybe use a VPN so that one of them appears to be running in one location and the other appears to be running in another location you know that may work I don't know 
my biggest problem for setting up multiple computers is I live in a very confined space. I live in an RV, so there's not a whole lot of room for me to set up a bunch of computers. And there's not any room for me to set up a rack type configuration either. So as long as I'm living in this RV, I'm stuck with that situation. And I'm depending on the comments of others as to what works and what doesn't work. But anyway... I wonder if anybody's tried running a edge node on one of those single board computers called a Raspberry Pi, uh, which can be had for $35, and they have a version of Windows 10 on them, I think. So uh, maybe somebody should look into that and comment about what their experience is. I can't imagine it would require that much computing power uh, when they're considering putting it into Samsung TVs and such. I would think that the Raspberry Pi would have more than enough power to handle it. So maybe somebody out there could try it and report back and let us all know how they did it. Well, that's it for this video. I hope you found it interesting or helpful or something. If you did, hit that like button on the way out. It really helps. And I'll see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, please like it, share it, and most importantly, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.